staying committed. It's tough. You know, you, you take a class and it's a full semester, right? It's not just like you go to class one day or you watch one lecture. No, 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 no. I mean, it's a full semester. It's several weeks, you know, depending on how long your semesters are. That is a long time to be studying one subject and you have tests and you have homework. I mean, it is a serious commitment and it's important, right? It's important to stay committed. So, uh, you know, how you learn and how you approach the subject and what resources you have and how you study and you know all of that you know your habits your, your motivations it all matters but one thing you have to do is you have to stay committed right because if you are not committed to what you are learning you know you you can't learn it right so stay committed so if you are feeling like you know you want to give up or maybe you had a bad test just remember that things get better in time, right? The longer you stay committed to a subject, the better it gets, right? Things start to fall into place. You know, there are some subjects out there that are just harder for some people than other people. It's just how it works. I don't know how it works. You know, I'm, I'm not some super genius, I'm just a regular person, but I know that I have struggled with specific subjects more than my peers. But I have come around, but right? I have I have been able to 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 learn those subjects. Maybe it took me longer than other people, but I was able to do it. At the same time, there were certain subjects that I was able to pick up really quickly and they made me feel really great about myself. Everyone is different, but no matter what, if you want to learn the subject, you have to stay committed. Good luck.